Welcome back to the channel on this glorious morning in the car park. <laughs> Taking a bloody storm for the leaf. Oh, dear me, honestly. Yeah, I can't believe it. First morning, really. <coughs> Sorry, my throat's still a bit. That I've got up and put a t shirt on and come outside. Bloody awesome. Look at all these uh, leaves now on this. You could see straight through this before. Well, only a few weeks ago. Yeah, I might even wash the van today. Look at this, right? The other night's up on the ledge and I hung my uh, uh, rubbish bag on here. And then I went to bed and forgot about it. It was hanging here, but when it, the wind, it was swinging. Look at that. There's a couple there. Loads there. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. But that's getting replaced anyway, because of that. Yeah, got my copy. It's my first one of the day as well. You and these bloody stones. Oh, Filled my diesel tank up yesterday and I also filled the seven litre one I got in the in the boot as well, so that should do me now for a few months to be honest if it carries on like this. Just been talking to a good friend of mine, Barry. Barry Wilson, he's the one that gave me the wood and helped me fit it all for these fishes. He just called in now. So we've had a coffee and a chat. It's great seeing you, mate. Bloody hell. Surprising how uh, a friendly face can just lift your day, isn't it? So, yeah, cheers, bud. I can't get over how bloody sunny it is. Bloody hell. 21.1 degrees inside this van. So, yeah. Proper summer's day in here. <laughs> I just had some cheese and crackers I have, so. It's 20 past 10 now in the morning. She's been fed, I've been fed, I'm getting watered. Oh, excuse me. Like I say, I'm gonna have a walk around Orza Street after. So. In Orza Street, gonna have a look around, might do a bit of shopping. Sage is with me, there's two hot in the van. And look at the bloody people you bump into. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go and have a look. Oh my god. At least the water's getting cut. Wilfred Owen. Apparently a famous poet. How do I know? Because James from By the Curb. I watch this channel. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. A bloody step there. <laughs> so this is the remains of what was a castle or a fort. I'll have a look when I go back down. Just climbed up 14 mile for this. Bloody hell! Got a good view from here though. Got the church steeple there. Find us, Sage! <laughs> yeah, that's all I see. It's alright, but yeah, I was expecting a bit more. All the years I've been up in this area, never been here, so yeah. It's all right, if you like that sort of thing. See the thickness of these walls, though. Yeah. My hand there. There's that one there. That's my van. Quite a nice path going down this thing. Woohoo!
Yeah, that was all right. Bloody steps are big though. So that's also Street. Not all of it. Just to uh, come out of Oswald Street now, come to a little park up. I got Burger King there. Been on here before, just a few videos ago. Because I'm going back into Oswald Street later on tonight, so rather than travel and then just to come back, I just come down the road. But yeah, sun's gone in. Bloody hell. But it's still quite mild, so yeah. Growing the old goatee backs. See what I can do with it. <laughs> Right, we're getting the back here and have a coffee because there's a van over there where I want to go. Because there's a grassy area there and I can just put her on lead then she can stay out in the grass. So I'll keep my eye out on him when he moves I'll make his space. Yeah right, got myself the old uh, van life special. One, I can't be bothered cooking. Just having a lazy day. Very really red hot. You are right. I'm having quite a few questions on the toilet and is the this drawer just housing it and I have to pull it out and do all this blah blah blah, blah and then put it all back? No, I'll just, without using it fully I'll just give you a demonstration. Now I do have to that's the design of that one pull that one out because there's a bit of a gap here but when it's pulled out it's it sits on that lovely so without doing a demonstration I sit on the toilet plenty of room on the sides here I've got all my toilet rolls everything to hand here cleaning products behind me in the drawer so jobs are good And I hope that clears up any questions. <laughs> there are bloody things you have to do. Yeah, I'm gonna go into Oswest Street now. Exception. Turn the radio down, don't want to get copyrighted. And uh, I'll probably see you like in the morning now because when I leave Oswest Street tonight, it's gonna be quite late. And then I'll just drive to a, uh, a park up and then uh, wake up and I'll press record again. See you in a bit. Well, see you in the morning. <laughs> Good morning. And the sun's out again. Absolutely brilliant. Oh, it's, yeah. Starting to feel more towards summer now, so it, yeah, it's bloody brilliant. 19 degrees in here, <laughs> and it's 10 o'clock in the morning. I've had a lazy one, I've had a couple of coffees and uh, just chilling. There we go, she keeps walking past with a bloody stone. She's just been fed now, so I didn't press record a minute ago because you wouldn't hear me. It's, a quite, it's quite a nice little spot to be honest. Like I say, it's just handy for my kids. Nice the weather's coming though, isn't it? So I will go a bit further afield now. Apart from the odd car going past. Just birds. It's really quiet here. I don't know what it's like. I know what it's like in the summer. You get all motorhomes all down the bottom here. And some up here. So, it does get busy. It's pretty tidy-ish in there. See my bed's made every day. Yeah. I haven't used a diesel eater yet since I filled it. <laughs> oh, is that a blinking coffee? It's come down to 18.1 now because I've had the door open a bit, but it's still quite warm, so it's bloody lovely. 
This light's been bloody brilliant. So. You put it on the first set and it's motion sensor, so I leave that on when she's in the van and I've got to pop out at night. So if she gets up for a drink of water, the light comes on and then after 30 seconds, if there's no motion uh, detected, it turns itself off. It's bloody brilliant for pets as well, you know. It doesn't work if she turns on the bed, but if she gets down from about here, it picks up and yeah, so she can see where the water is and what have you. I'm going to move from the car park now, I'm going to have a change of scenery. I fancy something with a view. kind of bike heaven up here so if you're into motorbikes this is the place honestly it's bloody awesome just gonna go across the road now to the ledge so it's basically across the way from this heads to head towards the slate quarry and you're there so see you in a minute first things first Got me coffee. I was gonna have a coffee and something to eat in the cafe in the Ponderosa, but all the bikes that were there, I think every bike had a, had a pavilion, it was packed in there. So, and the queue was to the door when I come out the toilets, and I thought, oh, I can't be bothered waiting in there. I got food and coffee, so I just got back in the van and came here on the ledge. If that wind had just dropped, it would be absolutely glorious. You know, look at that. Get away with an apple. <laughs> oh, she's taking a bite out of it. She knows what it is. She'll get to grips with it in a minute. It's gonna eat this now and have a coffee. Watch her playing with those. <laughs> I do love just coming up here and sitting here. Because listen. Nothing. Absolute silence. Bloody awesome. Sometimes you just need that reset button, you know, and it's... For me, it's sitting here. here I got two ideal places. It's here and anywhere where there's water. Whether it be a river, lake, stream, or the sea. Yeah, bloody awesome. 
Just looking down that bottom road now, there's a few cars, but in the last 10 minutes, there must have been about 30, 40 bikes coming up to go to the Ponderosa. Summertime there, it's um, it's just a huge meeting place for bikers. And uh, yeah, I'm heavily into bikes. So yeah, I used to have the old um, FZR 1000. It wasn't the Exip model, it was the one before the Exip. And uh, yeah, I loved that bike. It was uh, red, white, and blue. So yeah, that was all before I brought my back. So yeah, when I brought my back and I was walking again, I, I couldn't even get my leg over the bike, so I had to sell it. Oh, I cried what, as it went down the road. Yeah, the lad waved as he drove off, and yeah, I shed a tear. <laughs> what? He's, he's injured? What? He's, he's stuck in a well? And he's broke his leg? Oh my god! We better get 999! Absolute simple she is. <laughs> She's off again. <laughs> it's one of the best parts about parking up. <laughs> She's just gone past the door. One of the best parts of parking up in a place like this. She can just run. Yes. You having fun? You having fun? It is quite hot. Wind's died down completely now. It is absolutely beautiful here. She's been fed. I'm going to get fed. I don't know what yet, but I've got chicken casseroles and stuff here and new potatoes, so I might have that to be honest. I'm going to chill here for the night and uh, I want to thank you all for watching my videos I got to end it here and uh, yeah if you're not subscribed excuse me please press subscribe help me out help the channel out help Sage out <laughs> more Sage and uh, yeah it would be massive if you do that so I'm going to end it, like I said, and uh, be good, be safe, and as always, enjoy yourselves. Take care, guys. Till the next video. Bye for now. Bye. Bye! <laughs>